One of my favorite things to do as a minister of word and sacrament is to celebrate communion. This Sunday we'll celebrate communion, one of our two sacraments in the Presbyterian Church. When we talk about sacraments, we talk about them as visible signs of an invisible grace. And at communion, we use some different senses than we do in other worship services. You'll get to taste the bread and smell the juice before you drink it. At communion, we celebrate the life, death, and resurrection of Jesus Christ. It is a joyful feast for the people of God. What I love about communion is that when we gather at the table, we do so not as strangers or as friends or even as members of the church, but we gather as family, as brothers and sisters in Christ. It's a family meal. I also love that communion is not for those who have it figured out or those with the deepest faith or those who don't have any doubts. But at the communion table, we are forgiven of our sins. We are nourished for the journey ahead and we are equipped for God's ministry in the world. So come to church this Sunday to celebrate communion. Come to the table because it is Christ who invites you. Come and see that the Lord is good. Come and taste that amazing grace.